beginner's milling. Uh, recently, I had a friend call me. He had just purchased a mini mill. And he asked me, what do I need to know about this? How do I do this? Okay. I'd love to show him. So I thought we'd go over to the mill and show him how to do this. Let's get over there. First thing you have to do is make sure that your vice is straight. Because no matter what you do, if your vice isn't straight, nothing's going to come out right. So the first thing I showed him how to do is at least make sure it's straight with your ways. Let's do that right away. So the first thing we need to do is throw an indicator in here and just indicate this real quick. This is the quickest thing you could do for yourself because if you miss this uh, part, you may have wasted your whole day. I like to wind it up or put a load on this thing about halfway around. Uh, it's a 30 thousandths indicator. We'll go about 15 thousandths. Okay, we'll set our zero there. Now, this is the way I do it. I ain't saying that this is how you have to do it, but it's always served me well. Okay. Indicators on zero. I really only need to go about two inches. The part's only going to be two inches, and that will reflect everything I need to know. But we'll go from one end to the other. I've seen it move a couple of tenths, <laughs> which on a mini mill really shouldn't matter. Okay, I think this video is coming to an end, so I'm gonna have to say, until next time, enjoy.